Would you like an easy way to determine how much of two different feeds you need to mix in a batch to get a specific protein or energy level? If so, the Pearson Square Method may be just what you're looking for. It is a relatively simple procedure to go through in working out uh, the feed mix that, that you would be looking for. First off, just simply draw a square. In the center of this square, place the percentage of the protein or TDN that you would like to have in the completed mixture that, that you're putting together. In this case, we're going to uh, develop a feed mix that is 12% crude protein. So we put 12 in the center, and in this particular case, we're going to use corn that's 8% and a supplement that is 36% protein. What we will do then is write the percentage of these on the left side of the square on the upper left corner. I'm going to put the uh, supplement, so I write in 36. On the bottom left corner, I'm going to write in 8, which is the protein percent for the corn. Uh, next uh, step in the process is to subtract diagonally. So what we will do is subtract the smallest number from the largest and this then will be written on the right side. And again, we are subtracting diagonally. In this case, 36 minus 12, as we're going from upper left to lower right, this would give us a, a figure of 24. If we subtract uh, uh, the other diagonal, we will subtract 12, which is the largest, and take 12 minus 8, and that will give us 4, and that'll be in the upper right corner of the, uh, or outside the triangle. So this means that the mixture that we're going to be putting together that will be 12% protein will have 24 parts corn and 4 parts of the uh, protein supplement that we're looking at. To get the percentage of each ingredient to put in the mix, if we will add the 4 and the 24 together, this will give us 28. Then we will divide each of the numbers that we have on the right side by 28. If we divide 4 by 28, this will give us uh, 14.3%. If we divide the 24 by 28, and we're multiplying here by 100 to get on a percentage basis, this will give us 85.7%. So what we're looking at then is a mixture that is going to be 14.3% uh, supplement, 85.7% corn. If we want to get this uh, on a ton basis, we will simply multiply these percentages by 2,000 pounds. And this would give us 2,000 times 14.3 or 286 pounds of supplement. And if we multiply the uh, percent uh, corn in the ration, which is 85.7 times 2,000, that would give us 1,714. So we know then that this is what it will take to give us that mix, a ton mix that is going to be 12% protein. Uh, this Pearson Square, as you see, is a relatively easy way to uh, determine what needs to go in a feed mix. It does have some limitations in that you can only uh, look at two feeds at one time, and you can either uh, uh, work out the percentage for protein or for TDN at one time. So, you know, you'd have to go through it multiple times if you were looking both at protein and TDN. If you're looking at three ingredients, uh, this process really is not going to work very well for you. So I would recommend there that you get with somebody that does have a uh, computer uh, program that will allow you to uh, do some the same calculations we did here to figure out just how much of each feed is needed in a mix to get a uh, predetermined protein or energy content. Again, if you'd like additional help in Working out uh, a feed mix, uh, if you contact your local extension agent, he or she would be very glad to assist you.